Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Sure. Here's a comprehensive tutorial on how to use the Java SDK from GitHub, including how to clone a repository, set up your development environment, and run a simple Java program. Dash. Hashtag hashtag Java SDK tutorial. Hashtag 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 what is Java SDK? The Java Software Development Kit, SDK, is a collection of tools that developers use to create applications in Java. It includes a Java compiler, runtime environment, and various libraries that simplify development. Hashtag 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 setting up your environment. 1. Install Java Development Kit, JDK. Download the latest version of the JDK from the Oracle JDK website, https colon slash slash www.oracle.com slash java slash technology slash java z hyphen jdk 11 hyphen downloads dot html, or use open jdk, https colon slash slash open jdk dot java dot net. Follow the installation instructions for your operating system. To install Git, download and install Git from the official Git website, https colon slash slash git scmcom 3. Set up an integrated development environment, IDE. You can use any IDE of your choice. Popular options include IntelliJ IDEA, https colon slash slash www.jetbrains.com slash idea eclipse https colon slash slash www.eclipse.org netbeans https colon slash slash netbeans.apache.org hashtag 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 cloning a java sdk project from github 1. Find a Java project on GitHub. Visit GitHub, https colon slash slash github.com, and search for a Java SDK project. For example, you might want to explore the Java design patterns, https colon slash slash github.com slash iluw adder slash java hyphen design hyphen patterns, repository. 2. Clone the repository. Open your command line interface and run the following command, replace the URL with the repository's URL. 3. Navigate to the project directory. Hashtag 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 example code. Let's create a simple Java program that demonstrates the use of a basic Java SDK feature. We'll use a simple hello world example. 1. Create a new Java file. Inside your cloned repository, navigate to the SRC directory, or create one if it doesn't exist, and create a new file called helloworld.java. To write the code, open helloworld.java in your IDE and add the following code. 3. Build and run the program. Open your terminal and navigate to the directory containing helloworld.java. Compile the Java file using the following command. Run the compiled program. You should see the output. Hashtag 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 using a Java SDK library. Now, let's explore how to use an external library in your Java project. Suppose we want to use the popular JSON library for JSON parsing. 1. Add JSON dependency. If you are using a build tool like Maven, add the following dependency to your pom.xml. If using Gradle, add this to your build.gradle. If you aren't using a build tool, download the JSON jar file from Maven repository, https slash slash repository.com slash artifact slash com google.code.json slash JSON, and add it to your project's class path. To create a new Java file, create a new file called jsonexample.java in the src directory. 3. Write the code. 4. Build and run. 
compile and run the JSON example.java file similarly to how you did with hello world.java. You should see output that demonstrates JSON parsing. Hashtag 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 conclusion. In this tutorial, you've learned how to set up your Java SDK environment, clone a GitHub repository, and create a simple Java application. You've also explored how to use an external library, Chsun, for JSON processing. This is just the beginning Java has a rich ecosystem, and there are many more libraries and frameworks to explore. Happy coding!